Welcome back. We are here looking at the ETFs, and this is going to be my daily forecast for Thursday, May 6, 2021. If you like to support our channel, you're welcome to hit the subscribe button down here in the corner, hit the like button and the bell button to see our newest videos, and you're welcome to join us over at Patreon, where you can get access to our full technical analysis, our online trainings, and also our online courses. And uh, the link is down below. You're very welcome to join. So we'll start by looking at the uh, ARK Innovation ETF, and as you can see, we are down more than 2% the day, continuing to drop, and now we're trading underneath the 200 moving average. And this is a really bad sign for this ETF. We are significantly oversold as we are at 27 in the RSI. We're also significantly overstretched here, and we're also approaching area where we have found major support in the past. So if you look at this, this is an area that has basically have been major support in the past. So a break of this area here, that could open the door all the way down to the 300 moving average at 95. Other technical indicators are very bearish. So at this current stage, it is make a break at this point. A rally from here will most likely find major resistance at the 50 moving average up at 122. So let's look at DVI. So DVI is up 0.37% uh, at this current stage. Technical indicators are looking very positive and very bullish at, uh, still. So the only problem here is that we are significantly outside of the Bollinger Bands. So we could see this pull back towards the middle. That's a drop of roughly 2.5% towards the 20 exponential moving average and the bottom of this range. So that is to be seen. Um, otherwise, technical indicators are very bullish and the, the RSI is at the edge of being overbought at this point. So, however, we are very far away from this upper trend line, so there's a lot of room to the upside, but pullbacks could be expected before that happens. So let's look at VTI. So VTI has fallen. We're down 0.31% at this current stage. Technical indicators, they are all pointing to lower levels, or momentum is to the downside. MACD is bearish, RSI is bearish, CCI is fairly flat at this point, and our stochastic is bearish as well. We have broken the middle of the bullish band, we did that yesterday as well, and are most likely going to head towards the bottom, and that's a drop of 1.31%, or just above the 40 exponential moving average. If the 40 breaks, then we have the 50 here, and the 50 has been massive support in the past. To the upside, if we were to rally from here, they will most likely find major resistant at 220. So look, let's look at MCHI. So we have found support at the 200 moving average yet again. And this is, um, well, if we rally from here, we'll most likely find resistant at the 50 moving average, which is at 83 at this current stage. Break below the 200 moving average here, that could open the door all the way down to the 300 moving average all the way down here. So this just became red now, so we are down 0.01% at this point. So if you look at uh, at uh, technical indicators, we can see the MACD is bearish, the RSI is bearish, the CCI is bearish, and so is the stochastic. So the 20, 200 moving average is going to be a significant um, level, whether or not we break that, or whether or not we have find some major support here. So rally to the upside. Mostly defined resistant here and the breakdown below here that could open a massive drop all the way down to the 300 moving average of roughly 7.8% uh, to the downside. So let's look at uh, IVV. So as you can see, we're down 0.13% at this current stage. Technical indicators are all pointing to lower levels. So momentum is to the downside. The MACD is bearish, the RSI is bearish, CCI is flat, and stochastic is significantly bearish at this point. So the middle of the bullish band is holding. We did breach it yesterday, pull back, but if we stand, uh, stop underneath the uh, middle of the bullish band, we could drop towards the bottom, and that's a drop of roughly 1.5% to the downside. To the upside, we'll most likely find major resistance up here at the... Um, top of this range and that is roughly 427 so hope you find this helpful you're welcome to support our channel by subscribing hit the like button and the bell button to your new videos and you're welcome to join us over at patreon the link is down below good luck and thank you very much